Hello, I am Master Zhang from Body and Brain. Let's do some stretching for our back. We can start with a warm up. First, side to side. You can lock your hand, twist the side and your lower back. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Let's twist more deeply. Two, three, four. You can feel your side and your lower back. Five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay, let's twist upward 45 degree. Three, four, five. If you want to twist more, you can bring your arms more backward. Nine, ten. Let's twist more. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay, open your feet wide. Push hips backward, lower upper body. Slowly move side to side. Two, three. Straighten your knees and you can feel your hamstring and lower back. Seven, eight, nine, ten. Let's try a little bit more deeply. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay. Now we can start. Lower back exercise first. First, make your feet 11. Uh, important thing is making your right posture. First, gently lift up chest, make your lower back arch. When you make lower back arch, you can feel relaxation of, of your lower back. And after, you can lock your finger. And gently breathe in. And then gently a little bit chin down, stretch up deeply. If you bring your arms more backward, you can feel more stretching your back and then let's try with the breathing together breathe in and when you exhale you can relax easier let's just stretch a little bit more breathe out again breathe in and when you exhale a little bit relax more stretch more can you feel stretching your lower back you might feel relaxation of the back okay slowly breathe out okay let's try again breathe in this time we can stretch middle back. You can focus on middle back and then when you exhale, stretch your middle back. Can you feel stretching your middle back? You might feel stretching your rib cage too. Okay, breathe out. Let's try again. Breathe in. When you exhale, a little bit stretch more middle back. Breathe out. Okay, slowly return. Now let's try stretching upper back. Breathe in. And chin down between your shoulder blades you can stretch up and then you can feel stretching up shoulder blades armpit shoulders elbows higher okay one more time breathe in when you exhale stretch more breathe out okay slowly breathe out you can feel a little bit body is warmer okay side to side and this exercise is good for your lower back bend your knees and then lock your finger. Also, your feet always 11. Okay. And open your chest again. Breathe in. First, stretch your arms deeply forward. And then you can a little bit slouch your back and feel open your back. Naturally, you can close your chest. Breathe in deeply. When you exhale, open your back more. Breathe out. Can you feel stretching your back? Again, breathe in. Relax your back. Breathe out. Okay, slowly return. Now, this time, breathe in, bend your knees, push your chest over, and you can stretch your arms forward. And then you can feel stretching your lower back. Can you feel stretching your lower back? Okay, breathe out. Again, breathe in, stretch, push your chest forward. Naturally, you can stretch your lower back too. Breathe out. Okay, slowly, return. Again, breathe in. This time, we will twist the side. Stretch deeply forward. You can lock your hands, slowly twist the side. And at the time, if you bend your left elbow, naturally you can get benefit less. Stretch, straighten your elbows, then breathe out. Again, breathe in. Now you can twist a little bit more your lower back and your side. And you can feel twisting back and your side. One more time, breathe in. Lock your hand, twist a little bit more, breathe out. And you can really feel twisting your left side. Slowly return. Okay, you can move side to side. Okay, let's try the other way. 
lock your finger again, make your feet 11, open your chest. Slowly bend your knees, breathe in. You can stretch deeply. And then slowly twist your side and your lower back. You can look your hand. Okay, breathe out. Again, breathe in. You can twist your side and your lower back more, breathe out. At the time, straighten your right elbow. Again, breathe in. Twist the side and your lower back. You can feel twisting your lower back and your side. Slowly return. And your body is getting warmer. Can you feel? Okay, slowly side to side again. Now, this time you can lock your finger this way. And then open your feet this time wide. First, if you don't slouch your back, push hips backward. You don't have to go all the way down, just 90 degrees, okay? At the time, slowly raise your arms. Okay, we will do bouncing. Instead of bouncing lower upper body, push hips backward, raising arms. It helps your lower back releasing tension. Let's bounce 20 times. One, two, three. When you lower, you can breathe out. Relax. Seven, eight, nine, ten. Let's do ten more times. Two, three. Hips push back deeply backward. You can feel your lower back. Okay, slowly return. Shake, shake, shake. And then side to side. How is your lower back? Okay. Now, this time, let's rotate. First, hands on your side. And then first, push your hips forward. When you push deeply, naturally, you can feel stretching front and back together. And then, slowly rotate 45 degrees. And then another 45. You can use hips and stretching. Another 45. Push hips backward. Another 45. Another 45. And then it's 45 degrees, gently keep pushing and you can feel rotating whole, lower back, hip joint, and hip muscle. Can you feel it? Okay. Little by little, you can rotate bigger. If you straighten your knees, you can get benefit more. And then when you rotate sometime, you can feel like you can rotate bigger, getting better. Try making big circle with your hips. Okay, five. Depends on angle, you can feel many different spots. Your hip joint, left hip joint, right hip joint, lower back, and hip muscle. Okay, let's make a bigger circle. You might feel lower back getting warmer. It helps releasing lower back tension. Let's try a little bit more bigger. And okay, let's try the other way. One. And then feel your lower back hip joint more. Two. If you have a lower back pain, you can focus more rotating lower back. Three. Four. If you want to relax more, when you rotate, breathe out more. Breathe out. Okay, six. Seven. Do you feel getting over your lower back? Okay. Do you feel good? Eight. Nine. Ten. Okay. Slowly side to side. When you release tension in your hip joint, you can release tension lower back easier. Let's try rotating hip joint. First, you can lift up. When you lift up, a little bit inward better. After lifting up, slowly open. And then lift up, open. You can feel around the whole line hip joint. At that time, if you want to get strength over your leg, without lowering leg, you can rotate. While well, keeping balance is not easy, you can open and you can lower first. Lift up. This exercise helps releasing hip joint tension. Also, you can gain balance more. While you are using one leg, you can also develop strength of leg too. Seven. Can you feel rotating your hip joint? Eight. 
nine, ten. Okay, you can shake your hip joint and your hands. Okay, let's try the other leg. First, feet together. And then lift up, right leg, and then open. Lift up first, slowly open. If keeping balance not easy, you can lower your leg, it's okay. Lift up, open. And feel rotating around the whole hip joint. Five, six, seven. Can you feel your hip joint? Eight, nine, ten. Okay, shake. Now you can rotate this time. A little bit bend your knees. You can rotate more hip joint than lower back. One, two, three. Then keep trying. Relax your hip joint with exhalation. Breathe out. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Let's try the other way. One, two, three. Four, five, six. You might feel body is getting warmer around the hip joint line. Seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, shake, shake, shake. Also, you can twist side to side. Yeah, we can try sitting exercise. First, Hands on the floor and stand your knees. And then slowly bring your knee to the left. If you can make it both knees on the floor. If it doesn't touch, you can gently press with your left foot, it's okay. And then slowly twist upper body, try loop your right hand. Then you can feel your lower back and hip joint together. Can you feel? Okay. Let's try with the breathing together. Breathe in. When you breathe out, try relax your tense spot. Again, breathe in. And then you can twist the upper body more to the right. Slowly return. Okay, now let's try the other way. And then, if you want to get more benefit, you can move hands more backward and twist upper body to the left. Breathe in. When you exhale, a little bit twist the side to the left more. One more time, breathe in, breathe out. Okay, slowly return. This time move side to side, one, ten times, two, three, four. You can look other side, six, seven, eight, nine, 10. Okay, you can shake your hands. Okay, this time you can stretch your left leg and cross. And then hands on the floor. And then if you want to get more benefit, right hand bring close to hip. And then slowly bring your knee lower. And if this posture is not easy, you can move your hand a little bit close to your hips. And then if you can make it more, your knee bend more close to your hand. Then look to the right, then you can feel around the twisting lower back. Can you feel it? Okay, slowly return. You can shake your hands. And then you can switch your leg. Hands on the floor, bring your left hand close to your hips. Then slowly, you can lower your knee. You can do as much as possible. Even though you're not touching the floor, it's okay. Now breathe in, slowly look to the left, breathe out. Breathe in again, and then when you breathe out, relax. Slowly return. You can shake, and this time you can try first, right hand above your knee, and then left hand on the floor. Then breathe in, when you breathe out, twist the upper body to the left. You can gently push your right left knee. Breathe in. Gently push your leg and twist the upper body more. Okay, let's try the other way. Above your knee, 
hand on the floor, breathe in, gently push leg and then twist the upper body to the right. Again, breathe in, gently twist more, breathe out. Okay, return. This time, you can sit this way, then your right hand above your knee, your left hand on the floor. Okay, let's twist the lower back, breathe in. Gently twist your lower back, look your left hand, breathe in, and then twist more, breathe out. One more time, breathe in, and then you can feel twist your lower back deeply, breathe out. Slowly return, you can shake your hands, then next, left hand on your, above your left, right knee, and hand on the floor, slowly breathe in. Twist your lower back to the right and breathe out. And focus on twisting side and your lower back. Breathe in and breathe out. One more time, breathe in, breathe out. Slowly return. You can shake. Okay, let's finish. Okay, we finished back exercise. Okay, 감사합니다.